Hi everybody, um, I'm coming tonight to show you my new set of nails. Um, well, I've done everyone but my thumb, so I'm going to do my thumb for you guys. Um, but my inspiration for this set of nails was actually these rings. Um, the other night I watched a video that um, Tia Kiss 97 posted on how to make acrylic rings to match your nails. So, of course I fell in love with the idea and I just had to try it. Um, so I asked Ashley May and Abigail to make a glitter mix that I can put on a nail and to put on rings for them. So this is the one that Ashley May, whoop, this is the one that Ashley May made. This beautiful blue, okay. And then Abigail Main, this really pretty pink, very pretty, okay. And then what I used for the band was just um, the Blitz from Recollections, okay. That's all that the band is. So I made each of my girls a ring, okay. And then what I did for my ring was combined the two, okay, and I formed my ring, and it actually matches, here, it matches that nail better because it's split that way, um, but I did my tips to match my ring, so what it is, is I have the um, blitz underneath the two colors, and then I have Abigail's and then Ashley May's and I have it rotating between each finger. So, and like I said, I just finished doing this hand so I haven't buffed or shaped them and I'm going to do the thumb for you next. Okay. But the rings I thought was a really cute idea. And um, what I used for mine um, was the striper nail polish holder or nail polish bottle and I just drew my design that I wanted and taped it around the bottle and then that was what I made my ring out of that was what I used to do my ring so that's what I used um, but yeah so let me get started and do my thumb for you guys let me put the rings off to the side um, like I said, I'm using the pink that Abigail made for me. I am using the blue that Ashley May made for me. And then the Blitz by itself. Okay. And then my pink nail bed. Ooh, lots of shadows going on there. It's just the shimmery um, full coverage pink. Okay. Now, please bear with me because I didn't realize that I left my right thumb um, was the last one to do, and um, I am not left-handed, so this may take a few moments for me to actually get it done. Um, so please bear with me while I try to do this. Let me get that over there, that over there and try to stay in camera at the same time. Okay. Cat, now is not the time. My cat decided that she wanted to jump up on my table. Okay. So let's see if I can do this. And stay in frame. Like I said, I am by all means not a left-handed person, so this may take a few moments for me to get it right. Just bear with me a moment.
Oop. Sorry. Talking to myself now. My kitty is so funny. She's got a boo-boo on her tail. Um, she's an outside cat. And the other day she got too close to the front door and one of my kids accidentally shut the door on her tail. So she's got a boo-boo on her tail. Sorry, I'm not in frame there. I really jacked up that smile line. Let me see if I can't get it with the smaller brush. I'm trying to fix this. Sorry. Okay. That and I can't find my number eight brush. And the only one that I could find was a 4 and a 10. And I am not used to using either one of those. I like my number 8. And for some reason I cannot find my number 8 anywhere. And I'm like nowhere near in frame. Please bear with me, I am so sorry. I should have saved the other thumb, but I wasn't thinking. Okay, I can clean the rest of that up when I put the silver on. Okay. Oop, almost knocked that over. And then I'm going to come in with the blitz. And I'm going to put that right around the smile line. As close to the smile line as I can. This tiny brush is just driving me insane. Okay. So now that I have that on, Since I ended with the blue on this side, I'm going to put the blue on this side. So let me grab my blue. Try to keep it in frame for you. Oh, and of course I picked up a ton of stars. Look at that. I actually may put a ton of stars in this mix. And of course, since they're all on the bottom, you're not going to be able to see most of them. And then I'm only doing half the nail in the blue. I'm 
trying to keep the stars up to where they can be seen once I encapsulate it. I'm trying anyway. And for those of you who don't know, I do my nails outside. So yes, you just heard that truck go by. Okay. So there's that half in blue. Looks like I need to add a little bit more. Just a little bit. Right there. Okay. So there's that. And then I'm going to come in with Abigail's pink and do the other side. And she put stars in hers too, so let's see if I can pick up some of those. Not in that batch. She didn't put near as many stars in hers as Ashley Mae did, which is a good thing. But. There's a big piece of mylar. Don't know if the camera's picking that up or not. So there's that. That my lash just right there on the corner. Okay. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to come in and encapsulate it all with the clear. So let me go ahead and open that real quick. I don't like to leave it open because like I said I am outside and I don't want any of the you know stuff floating around outside to get inside of it. Okay. So I'm going to pick up some clear. Once again I am using this huge brush that I hate, but I can't find my number eight, so this will just have to work for now. I'm going to encapsulate the glitter first so that I don't drag glitter throughout the entire nail. Sorry, my dish was about to fall. And then I'm going to come in and just put a very thin clear coat over top of the pink. And then I am going to let that dry, and then I'll file, shape, and buff it, and I'll be right back. Okay, so now I'm back inside. Um, I have shaped and polished and put the clear coat on, and they turned out very pretty. Okay. Um, so once again, these are the rings that I made using the same acrylic. Um, and I can't remember if I mentioned her name or not, so let me see if I can find her video again real quick. Did you find her? Uh, no. be I want to say that it's like Tapia97, or nope, Tia Kiss, 
T-I-A-K-I-S-S-9-7. Um, she was the one that inspired me to make the rings, which then inspired me to do my nails. So, yeah. This one was Ashley Mae's, that one's Abigail's, and then that one's mine. So, there they are. The beautiful rings that I made along with my nails that I made. So thank you for watching. Um, don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. Bye ladies.